Hello guys, welcome back to another Doctor Who figure with you by me. And just to let you know that I'm starting to buy all the Gelf Doctor Who figures so I can start building the Gelf. And this is the first one I'm going to be reviewing, and that is the Master Regenerated. <coughs> I got it on Amazon for £10, which was a bargain for a very rare figure. Um, I ordered it on Monday, today's Wednesday, so not yesterday, but the day before I ordered it, and it came very, very quick. So, at the top it says, include, collect and build, Gil and some rays. And at the top it says, series 3 and in flight 5 plus. And then at the bottom there's a picture of the Master, logo of Doctor Who, and then the Master regenerated. turn it around you just have the picture of the um, girl and then how to build your girl and then some descriptions to tell you all about it I think that's the barcode I'm not sure here's some information and there's the logo of helpful options and at the top it says collect and build collect and build yeah sorry and then the girl there and it's this thing collect all seven packs, eight parts to complete your girl phantom figure. Seven packs to collect. So, this looks like a really good one. I'm going to pick out the box and review. Well, that took t fifth, 10 to 20 minutes getting that thing out of the box. Really scratched myself, but anyway, here's the figure. <coughs> so, first, we can have a look at the girls. There's not really special features or anything on this figure. It's just like a blue kind of moulded plastic. The head can't move, by the way, so you think it can move. If you force it, it could break, so that's why I'm not going to do it. That, I think it makes that noise because that's where... It, it's all been connected but there's no articulation on this blue model figurine whatsoever so moving on to the master he's a really good video video <laughs> he's a really good figure his bottom waist can move 360 degrees his arms can move 360 degrees the bell joints can move 360 degrees. They can lift up and down. Again, same on the other side. The bell joints can move up like that. Down. Up. Down. Very stiff. So yeah, his head can move 360 degrees. I'm not sure about his hands. Um, yep, his hands can move 360 degrees. Try the other hand. Yep, that can move 360 degrees. His knees can bend down like that and up. So yeah, that's all the articulation on this figure. So on detail, it is really nicely done. I like how he's done the ring there. I like the little chain gangly thing down here. I like the back where the straps are there. And I love the paint job on it. It's done really good on the paint job. So yeah, this looks like a really good figure. And I should bring him into one of my Doctor Who figure adventures one day. Maybe some point in series two. I like the little things on his little fake red jacket really nice so out of 10 I would give this figure a 9 out of 10 because this is a really great figure and everything but the articulation is very very stiff probably because it's a 2009 figure and it's just been kept away in storage Thank you for watching. I hope you enjoyed. Please like, subscribe and comment. Goodbye.